Ayan, good morning everyone. Pasensya na late ako. Nagbago ng interface si YouTube. Hindi ko alam saan hanapin yung live. So, medyo nanganga pa ako ngayon sa dilim. Hindi ko alam an paano, paano ba to. <laughs> Nagbago ng interface si YouTube. Hindi ko na-research ito. Ah. So, pasensya na if I'm late. Uh, good morning everyone. Um, today, we're gonna be talking about my recommendations sa market. Ayan. So, kamusta naman kayo? Kamusta ang trading nyo nyo? Um, market is, bumalik yung volume na manipis. So, so, na manipis eh. so really, uh, positions aren't moving that much. There are some of position of hours na maganda naman. So far, so good. Um, I am enjoying, kaso nga lang, um, at the same time, puyat. But I am enjoying... Um, the perks of the volume of the international market um, nag 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 post ako ka, kagabi kanina madaling araw na nag take profits na ako kay Amazon we were able to what they call this we were able to um yan take profits kay Amazon share ko lang po sa inyo right last night at around may oras ba dito wala eh walang oras so uh, nine hours ago um, Amazon, 10% gain. So, congratulations sa mga nag-copy trades sa akin. Most of them are already in the green. Um, yun, except doon sa mga kakapasok lang. Medyo may pula pa yung mga kakapasok lang. But, uh, majority of those who have copy traded me are already on the green side. I'm planning to flatten out my port, meaning yung portfolio ko. Hindi muna ako magbubukas. Um, once we, t- we, ne- we take profits in oil, um, it means na wala akong hawak support ko. That means my position has plat- flattened out. Um, that's advantages for those who are copy trading me para ano um para mariset yung proportion natin. So everyone uh, makakapag makakahabol yung mga tao. So if hindi pa kayo nakapag copy trading, um better start na po. Um sayang naman po your opportunity yung opportunities international market plus meron pong uh, mag trade para sa inyo. All you need to do is copy trade me if you want to or other people out there and dami pong pwede ninyong i-copy trade uh diyan sa 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 Itoro uh, dito sa Itoro and dami po diyan so um take advantage of it sayang naman po yung pera na dumadaloy sa international market um sobrang laki po let's take advantage of that right so um ano ma um let me just ready my list and so I'll go to your comments. Good morning, everyone. Once again, good morning to my daughter Laika. All right. So, and Joel Ligares, good morning. Arman Tanglao, good morning, Sir Lloyd. Good morning, then. Ginabing ko kaya nyo ngaseyo. Hop, Sir Lloyd. Chart request po sana IRC tags. PHA and Tesla. Uy, may international na natin tayong mga request. May magandang pinalabas ngayon si Tesla. Si Google, may magandang pinalabas ngayon kaya nagbabound si Google. So, nga lang, hindi muna ako papasok. STV Trader, good morning. ISM and ATN. Alright, let's check these out. Alright, so Addison C, good morning. Makian. Asa na yun? Bumaba bigla yung comments. Makian, good morning. Monet Lagman, good morning sir. Insights po on si SEC, BPI, and AP. Let's check this uh, group out. Ayan. So, Web naman from Keting. Good morning, Keting. Lionel Kasing, si Web naman. Kamusta natin si Web? Um, Tayin ko muna mag-uptrend talaga si Web eh. Kasi hindi, wala, hindi pa lumalabas yung news ni Web eh. Mark Lizaso, EEI, sir. Thanks. All right. Kamusta natin si EEI? Then, ganda ng bounce ng EEI. Eh. VLL from Lionel. Yes, si VLL. Somehow, nagsa-sideways pa naman. So far, so good. Hi, may Villefort. Good morning, sir. FPH. Huh. Excuse me. Pasensya na po. Um... O nga, alas dos, alas tres na ako natutulog eh, kasi sa international market. I've been practicing, um, um, been practicing the international market. Getting a hold of the trends and mga galaw ng market nila. So, you have to observe these uh, movements. So, you have to spend time since I am gonna be uh, concentrating more on it. So, medyo inaantok pa. But, tuloy pa rin ang tulong natin sa PSE pa rin. Hindi natin iiwan ng PSE. Siyempre, right? stay invested kay PSE. Um, yun nga lang, hindi na akong gaano aggressive kay PSE. Nagpo-position trades lang ako whenever I see a stock that is uh, is cheap and I think it's already bottomed out, pinapasok ko. So, yun lang ang ginagawa ko ngayon sa PSE. Position trades lang. 
GB Happy Morning, Sir Lloyd. Morning then Inside si Boy DMC. SMPH and IRC. DMC is good, right? Aso ah, so nga lang. Nasa taas na. SMPH then medyo nasa taas ni. So, I think it's gonna go on uptrend. We did recommend. Si SMPH ba yung na-recommend natin? Hindi, si SMC. Right, so tingin nyo po, tutuloy sa pagtaas today ang CPG. I can't really say, ang ganda ng galaw ni CPG yesterday. So guys, isa yan sa mga bagger picks ko noon, October pa yan. So CPG is already, is already starting to move. Sabi ko sa inyo, magbodega na. So hopefully, nakapagbodega na kayo. Um, I am just riding it right now. So wala na pong stress sa pag-ahabol. Um, yan, Mark, morning. Um, Dave, guapo daddies. Good morning to your family too. Uh, Enrico Costuna, good morning. Um, JPM Games, Sir Lloyd, any thoughts on ABBA? What will be the price I'm planning to for long-term ABBA? I have an average of 0.66. Alright, so ABBA, anong price? Hindi ko po alam eh. Hindi na... <laughs> Guys, um, it's like this. I don't really try to predict the market. Hindi ko po... Um, para, that way... I am. Not, I will not stress myself out. Parang parang pag-ibig lang yun. Eh. Never expect too much, right? Wag kayo mag-expect ng malaki. Na ano? As long as you're earning, okay na yan. Um, masasaktan lang kasi kayo. So let the market do its thing. Wag nyo po subukan hulaan, right? So yung hula po ginagawa natin is we just bet that it it may go up. We don't really know where it is gonna go. So pag hula natin na uy umakyat nga siya, hindi natin alam saan papunta yan. Um, if it goes above 30%, then swerte natin yan. If ever 20 lang, 15 lang. So, the market wants to do what it wants to do. Let it do what it wants to do. Just act accordingly. Right? Pag tapos na yung uptrend, edi lumabas ka, then ten mo ulit mag bottom out, then pasok ulit. So, let the market do uh, its thing, and then you react accordingly. Ganun lang dapat. Hindi yung nanguhula kayo. Right? So, um... JPM Jing Martin um, good morning James De Lambaca good morning uh, King Bakay then coach Puyat Kake Ito <laughs> nga eh Marlo Baroro Mang Buntag Sir Lloyd magkano po leveraging fee sa Itoro leveraging fee sa Itoro depends eh. hindi ko na memorya hindi ko memoryado yung leveraging na fee eh, kasi hindi pa ako nagle-leveraging dahan-dahan um, but yeah you can see it here let's just go, you just need to go to it here help and then fees, right? Market hours and fees, which is um on the first part right here. If you click on that, um, and so for example, sa uh, asan ba yun? Other fees, ito. Other fees. Nope, 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 nope. Other fees, withdrawal amount, conversion. Sa crypto yan. Eh. Let's try to go to stocks. And baka nito yung leveraging. Ayan. So, overnight fees ito may stocks overnight fees um for CFD trades no leverage and short positions for example um yan so buy position no that's not it hours asan yung ano leveraging fees and um not really sure nasaan but um if you wanna test it out hindi ko pa sino pinag-aaralan niyan i'm still in the process of ano i'm still in the process of mastering um, the fees, balancing it out. I have to consider the fees also when I trade. So, yun. Um, but, I know dito natin makikita yan. And not the copy people. Trade markets. Um, when you click on a stock, for example, this stock, and then you trade it. Right. So, leveraging 0.28 sa times 5. Kung times 1, wala. Times 2, 0.11. Right. So, sa weekends, medyo malaki. 0.34. But 0.11 po, and times 2, and times 5 is 0.28. Not really sure how it eh, how it expands, but bas basically, um, nagbabaro kayo ng pera sa leveraging. Eh. So, pera ng, pera ng, what you call this, ng brokers ang ginagamit nyo, kaya may fees. Right, so, Lionel Kasing, somehow your message got retracted. Sorry about that. Can you please post it again? Alvin Rabanis, good morning, Sir FLI and IRC. Uh, salamat po, God bless. All right. So let's check these out. Um, Roland Hamela, good morning, Sir Lloyd. Commodities lang ba may overnight fees sa Itoro? Um, commodities, majority of them merong overnight fees. Um, ang indices, ang alam ko, wala rin ang indices. Eh. So overnight fees, ah, meron pala, overnight fees per one unit. Yan, so 0.18. Right, so, yan po. But you will be earning in dollars din naman. So one 
uh, usually pag nag-earn ka ng mga $30 so 0.18 in in ano in 30 days is uh, in 10 days is just $1.08 so ayun um those are the fees meron po iba-iba I'm, I'm still not uh, I'm still not um, I haven't still mastered this uh, yet so I can't uh, hindi ko pa maano hindi ko pa ma I'm I'm not, I'm not yet able to really grasp the ano uh, the the extent of eToro's ano uh, uh, exp- uh, of their ano uh, what they call this of their fees kaya po um dahan-dahan po ang ginagawa ko right now I'm I'm still studying may she share yun pala i share ko sa inyo ngayon I I found a channel that is um yung about eToro naman ang she share niya lahat um everything you need to know about eToro meron um I'll share it later when um around 8:40 when we officially start nga pala guys paki-share po ang video please share the videos to your Facebook walls and to your trading groups para naman malaman ng mga newbies na may program na ganito that can help them in return Ronaldo De Jesus good morning Sir Lloyd pwede bang mag-fund ng eToro gamit different PayPal accounts next yes pwede naman kasi hindi ko naman credit card ang gamit ko on my account so ibang credit cards ang ginagamit ko so Blaze Fernandez DD sir right let's check out DD all right so Uku788 Sir Lloyd paantay ako tagal nung request ko na credit card kasi di pa tuloy ako makapag copy trade oy bilisan mo kasi mag-open na ako soon i'm going to be flatting out the prof- uh, the position most probably next week Right, so that will be the best opportunity to start copy trading. Pwede na start copy trading actually ngayon since um, yung position ko naman kay oil, maliit pa naman ang risk, 1.98% pa naman siya. So pwede na kayo mag copy trade actually. Right, uh, JPM Games, I'm still hesitant to go into international market. Um, yeah, JPM, kasi siguro sa oras and you, it's an uncharted territory for most of us. That's why dinahandahan ko lang muna, right? When you enter international market, start with small amounts, right? It's start small lang, right? Um, yon three twenty na ngayon, uh, sir three nineteen pa ang caption mo oh, nga eh, kasi hindi ko ma control yung interface ng ano, hindi ko man control yung interface ng live kaya nagka problema ako well, sorry about that. Malit pa kasi ang funds ko from JPM, Lawrence Reyes, sir good morning. Pa check naman si PHA and CHP or si PHA and Jen na si CHP naman kung saan si PHA kahapon umabot ng piso ah. Right, Beatrice Takuba, good morning sir Lloyd, MRC please. Write this down. MRC. Good morning from Junel. <laughs> Bert Lobertas, uh, Ryan, John Alcantara. Sir, good morning, Popi. Guys, si Popi medyo mataas na yan. Ha? So, konti ingat lang. I did recommend Popi doon sa baba. Huwag po kayo naghahabol sa baba as much as possible. Um, but yeah, uh, meron namang uptrend na following. Pero so nga lang, if in this kind of market, I really don't want you to be aggressive on those stocks na nagliliparan na. Gila Buero, good morning. Sir Lloyd watching from Singapore. Good morning, Sir Jen Robert Castle Tort. Good morning, Sir. MRC, please. All right, so let's check out MRC. Downtrend pa ba siya? Um, Nerd Peck, good day, Sir. B Core, thanks. Yes, B Core, nagsa sideways pa naman. Bert Lobertas, how dividend works po and ano po implication nito sa isang stock? Um, dividend basically, um, very good question. Dividend basically gives you extra, right? Um, dividends. Hindi obliged ang company magbigay ng dividends to us common stockholders pero they it's up to them right um dividends depende na yan sa company if ever meron silang retained earnings retained earnings meaning yung extra sa mga kinikita nila parang naipon nila they can give it out to stockholders as dividends para bonus para para maganahan naman sila so bonus nga eh so they are going to give you money per stock that you hold on to um meron siyang cash dividends um you're going to earn cash uh, for example 10 cents 10 cents per stock so if you have 1000 stocks you get 1000 times 10 cents so please do the math so ganun um meron din namang stock dividends tulad nung nangyayari kay Lotto 100% stock dividends naman sa kanya meaning 100% for so if you have uh 1000 stocks um they're going to give you 1,000 also kasi 100%. So, magiging madodoble yung stocks mo. Um, kaso nga lang, problema, after dividends, usually nagdodrop yung prices because it's gonna balance out with the number of stocks that is out there. Meaning, madodoble ang number ng stocks ni Lotto, meaning, most probably mag-half yung price niya. So, you have to consider that also. Um, also, in the no- normal cash dividends, usually bumabagsak after X date kasi 
um, there are people who are after the dividends lang. Once nga na eligible na sila sa dividends, lalabas na kagad sila kaya bumabagsak rin minsan. Right? So, if ever malaki ang um, dividends na bibigyan ng isang company that's attractive to investors and traders, um, pumapasok ang mga tao kaya umaakyat rin ang stock. Pero babagsak naman. <laughs> Bert Lubertas, who good? <laughs> Nanette Milheiser, good morning po. Mac, right? si Mac hindi nag-breakout yesterday so hindi natin minasok. That's why we always wait for the breakout. I did recommend Mac for the breakout yesterday. Kung mag-breakout man siya, pasukin natin kasi um, breakout yon ng cup and handle. Kasi nga na hindi nagtuloy. So, Iwas muna, right? Um, asa na yun? Uh, Reynaldo, good morning sir. Magandang buhay, pasilip si VLL. Right, let's check that out. Dennis Rodriguez, hello sir. Morning na kaya, uh, musta na kaya si VUL, PHA, and ATN. Wala pa eh, hindi pa gumagalaw eh. Si PHA bumabagsak rin. So, kamusta natin yan ngayon? Ichigo Ogichi, good morning sir. Pasingit po ng IRC. I think IRC is already here. Yan, so silipin natin yan. Lawrence Reyes, in case... Your daily pick from yesterday didn't perform well on your suggested entry price. Mas lalo pang bumaba like your suggested enter 2 peso to pero close siya ng 85 centavos. Pwede pa ba pasukin? Wag muna. We always wait for the bounce. Pag bumaba siya, just wait for the bounce. Like for example, si Bicor yesterday is in my recommendations. Let's check out the chart of Bicor, right? So Bicor, yesterday, um, ay, nag-bounce pala si Bicor. Sino ba yung nareko ko kahapon na hindi umakyat? Um can't remember pero mga meron kasi eh um was that i forgot sino yon um na hindi hindi umakyat right so if ever bumagsak lang siya hindi ko muna irereko yan for example eto nangyari kay Bicor um anyways nag green naman si Bicor i thought red to eh so yeah for example ganyan nireko ko si Bicor nang ganyan right so actually dito ko pa nireko si Bicor eh. but nireko ko ni si Bicor nang ganyan pwede niyo pasukin yan uh, the next day Right? Uh, for for on, if I recommended it today, you can get in. Um, so yun yun ang yari kay Bicor today. So flat out lang naman siya. So that's still okay. Minsan bumababa siya na nagigipula. Let's say this is a red. I will not be recommending it yet. But for those who have already entered, okay pa naman siya. Cause the the support is still holding right there, de ba? Kung bumaba man si Bicor. So as long as that support holds, basically that's still good to get into. Um, I just don't recommend it because I always recommend on a bounce. So, pag nag-green yan ulit, ire-recommend ko yan ulit. So, ganun lang for ano, for, for my recommendations. And then, as long as, yun, um, planuhin nyo lang po yung exit ninyo. I always exit around below 3% sa support. So, um, price range dito sa PSE, ang, ano ko, ang risk ko is around 3%. So, 3% below support. So, dyan. So, hanggang dyan po. Hanggang 2.62 ko po siya i-hold. Pag na-hit yung 2.62, lalabas na ako. So, that's basically it. Alright. Um, let me just load my chart layout again. Nawala eh. I don't know why. Alright. So, let's continue. Sarah Bilyeza. Good morning. Um, Josan from Hong Kong. CHIB. And uh, SECB, please. Alright. So, these are good companies. So, let's check these out. Um, Meme Cruz, hi sir, if I use credit card now to fund eToro, then after I use debit card naman, when the time comes, I need to withdraw, saan po mapupunta yung money? Um, that I'm not sure of, right? Hindi ko sure kung saan mapupunta. Um, I would strongly recommend that you message the support first before you do the withdrawal para ma-facilitate po nila ang withdrawal. They can do the withdrawal process for you. Right? So, mas maganda pa ganyan. Right? So, Burnstorm TV. Um, good morning, sir. Pacheck si Annie. Right? Um, pwede na ba pasukin? Divergence. Uy, may divergence si Annie. Kamustahin natin. Right? Chito Durban, Mayang Buntag, Sir Lord. Greetings from Vietnam. What are the best picks for today? Salamat kayo. Let's discuss that in a while. It's 8.40 in the morning. BJ Julian. Julian, sir. Uh, pwede ba joint account sa eToro? I'm not sure if pwede. I haven't, I haven't tried that. Um, haven't seen any questions like that before. So, very, very good question. Uh, yun, si Jaime said, LTG at Mac Andy Umakyat. For example, si LTG. Right? So, yun, si LTG pala yung nasa isip ko. For example, si LTG is here. Ayan, hindi umakyat si LTG. Hindi nagtuloy-tuloy yung bounce niya. Um, at this point, si MA20 ang support natin. But the MA20 has been sustaining. So, 
um, pwede pa natin pasukin ito. Still good. If ever pumasok man kayo, tapos na, hindi naman nag-sustain yung bounce niya at bumaba, we're still at the support level. Right? So, since still okay, hindi ko muna i-recommend si LTG. I'm waiting for another green before I will be recommending it. So, I don't know if it's gonna bounce today. Ayan. So, I don't know if it's gonna bounce today or not. Right? Um, ito si LTG, di ba? Nirecommend ko yesterday because of this bounce of this pullback. Malapit na siya sa MA20 eh. So, nga lang, yesterday, uh, medyo mataas yung open niya. And then, it went down. And then, ito, the best entry was MA20. So, dapat, kung nireco ko na yan, abangan nyo na within the day kung ano mangyayari. Yeah, try to get try to get in as near as the support as you can. This the stock was going down. Still okay for me, right? Um, so, mga pumasok dyan kay LTG, especially on the green day. Okay pa naman siya. The support is still holding, right? Nagsusustain pa naman. So, you as long as the MA20 is holding, pero hindi ko po siya ni-recommend ngayon. Why? Because I haven't seen a green yet. I always wait for a green before I want to recommend it. Just to be responsible with my with my recommendations. And so, ladies, Fee, good morning, Sir Lloyd and Miss Apple and Laika. Good morning din sa inyo. Estela Petronio, good morning, Sir. How about Pip and FNI? Sir, FNI is in my pick for today. Right? So, we'll discuss that in a while. Si Pip naman. Okay rin naman si Pip. Kaso nga lang, tagal na ng consolidating niya. So, hopefully soon. Position trade naman yan. Wala naman charges yan. Sir, how about CH Win DMW? DMW masyado mataas na. I did recommend that at the bottom. Si CHP naman. Si CHP, kamustahin natin. Medyo mataas na si CHP eh. Too high for me already. Habner, a special coach. Good morning. Kudos to you and your effort in being fund manager sa Itoro. Let, literally, let's get rich together. Para kay Miss PSE naman, pasilip si RRHI Green, Jerry, Phoenix, LR, and MRSGI. Kamustahin natin ang mga ito. Alright, so last two lang muna alright, before we continue, okay? Uh, good day, Coach Green from Bull and Bear. Yan, nasulat na yan. Arubi, good morning, Sir Lloyd. Good luck sa next trade mo sa Itoro. Thank you so much. Para naman sa atin yan lahat. Big Honey, 15. Sir, how about CPG po? Si CPG, guys, medyo mas at mataas ni. Alright, I did. October pa yan. Noon ko pa sinasabi si CPG, magbuday ka na kayo. Doon pa sa baba. And then I recommended it again on the uptrend, on the uptrend. Pero ngayon, nasa taas na si CPG really hard it's really irresponsible for me if i recommend cpg still um i cannot recommend for you to buy this guys uh hirap eh <laughs> right baka maipit kayo eh um ako lang sabihin ko lang sa inyo si cpg guys is on a very good comeback sabi ko sa inyo grabe tong comeback na ito ni cpg pag nang nagkataon i think it's still gonna go up but you're, um, I strongly want you to become position traders. Kada ng volume ni CPG kahapon. I think it's still gonna go up, but as position traders, hindi po tayo naghahabol dyan, right? This is a Bollinger Band trigger, upper Bollinger Band trigger that should be sparking an uptrend. Um, I strongly recommend wait for a pullback before you wanna get in again. So, pag nag-pullback yan at nag-bounce, that will be a good entry. We have another uptrend naman dito. So, this is the best entry point. Basics po tayo, right? So, just enter there at the support. Wag po natin habulin dyan sa taas, please. Wag po, right? Just wait for the pullback. Uh, darating yung panahon, i-re-recommend ko rin ulit yan. Si CPG. Morning sa lahat. Green po, LTG, at MAC. Yan, so, Shells DV, PIP, and uh, X please, alright, I'll write down X alright, so ito lang muna uh, for the meantime, let's stop with Shells DV morning Sir Lloyd, Amil Angelo morning everyone, sold na rin Amazon ko alright, good job sa Amazon, laki ng gains natin kay Amazon, alright, so um, let's continue alright, so first up guys, I just wanna share to you a YouTube channel very important, for especially those so mga gusto matuto ng copy trading ito yung isa sa rason bakit napupuyat ako right now so, um, I want to share to you this guy. Ayan. So, um, social trading vlog. Right? I want you to subscribe. I strongly recommend that you subscribe to this channel right here. So, lahat po ng um, vlogs niya. Um, this is um, more than a year already ang vlogging niya. Um, maganda dito. Right? Um, na, meron siyang mga reviews for, uh, for traders. Meron siyang... Uh, eToro for beginners tutorials. Um, how much money will I make using eToro? How to copy trade and everything. This guy, so that hindi ka na kailangan mag-create ng video. Subscribe this uh, to this guy. Right? Meron siya mga updates. Um, meron siya mga ano? Uh, meron siya mga tutorials sa mga problema 
um, sa copy trading. Ayan. So, for example, this one right here, I, I was watching this last night. Kasi hinahanap ko, bakit may problema sa copy trading sa ibang tao? Hindi lang makopya yung ibang trades ko. Meron palang minimum si eToro per copy trade. So, dapat per unit, nasa more than $1 dapat. Right? So, for example, I trade a huge portion of my port. A, yung copy, uh, yung copy trade amount nyo lang is um, 2 pesos. I mean, yung copy trade amount nyo is nasa 2 pesos. I mean, $200 lang. So, baka hindi nyo po makapit trade sa akin. Um, siguro, I'll just spend... We are dumb money. Uh, we quit our day jobs to do this. I'm going to check out. Alright, so I wanna... Uh, I want to share this to you. Not anymore. So, um, actually, there's that question. How much? Okay, so, mamaya na lang. Basta, tignan niyo po itong video na ito para sa copy trading nyo. Um, that's why I placed in my minimum copy trade amount, I strongly recommend mga $1,000. Um, basically, it will work at around $500. Okay na si $500 to copy trade me. Yun nga lang, yung mga maliliit na mga funds. Um, baka hindi po kayo makapasok sa trades ko. Kasi, ang minimum copy trade per unit ni ano ni Itoro is dapat $1 per unit. Just refer to this video. This will greatly help you and answer your questions there. So this guy is going to be a very big help for you. Again, um social trading vlog. Yun po yung channel name niya. Just search for him in YouTube. I'll post his link here also. So makatulong po yan siya. Right? So may utang to sa akin tong taong to. I'm gonna give him subscribers. <laughs> Anyways. And so, um, yun lang i-share ko sa inyo for today. Um, to improve your knowledge in copy trading. Never stop learning. Even me, I'm already in copy trading. Um, I'm still studying it, right? Even if we're already earning. It never, never cease to, uh, to learn, okay? Um, let's go to my picks for today. Ang picks ko for today are... Let me post it in the comments. Ayan, food, Pal, ABG, Bloom, Tech, Primex, and FNI. So, yun po yung mga recommendations ko for today. Unahin natin si food. I hope everything is okay. And Sir Lloyd, as per eToro, withdrawal of fund profit will be returned to credit card registered second bank account na registered near sir. Required si eToro user to register alternative. Uh, yes, tama yan, Lawrence, right? So, um, just check out the ano, instructions of the withdrawal. If ever you need help, just contact their support. Meron tayong support for ano. Meron tayong support sa Itoro sa Philippines. All right. If what if yung account name ang PayPal is different sa account ng Itoro, pwede rin by transfer. Okay lang yan. Walang problema yan. All right. So unahin natin si food. Food. Nain ko muna ito mga guys ha. Mamaya, let's go back to your questions later. Food has been sustaining that support very well and we have very good confirmation from food. Um, medyo healthy na yung ano niya, yung volume niya. So, that should be a good sign for food. Pwede natin natin itest yung support na yan. That's becoming solid already. So, food guys, um, most probably okay na siya ngayon. Just in case we fail, uh, we are wrong. Just cut loss below that support guys ha. Hindi ito guarantee na aakit ang mga stocks na pinipili ko. Right, so I'm just looking for the low risk positions as much as I can. Si Pal naman for a good company is already making a support right here on this level. So saying naman yung support, I think this is a good support already. We're seeing a curve already, so nagsa solidify and uh, nagsa stabilize na siya. This is a good stabilization point. If ever magfail siya, just cut your losses. But I think this is good already. Hinug na si Pal, pwede nang laruin. Um, pwede niya positionan yan. Test buy lang guys. ABG. Yan. Si ABG din. Also, ABG is at the levels where it is very stable already. This is the main support of ABG. Look at this. Um, 1, 2, 3. We've hit that level already and we have already a bounce. So, that's a very solid support for ABG. That's the best position. If I or you, magsisimula na akong mag bodega kay ABG. Bodega here, buy more. If ever, ba ba ba, buy more. Because this is the lowest levels ABG had uh, for how many, uh, matagal-tagal na rin yung support na yan. Uh, this is a very, uh, this is, uh, ABG has been doing well din naman. So, yeah. Um, this is a good support. Um, gusto ko test buy niya lang. Alright, wag na naman kayo maglagay ng malaking pera. Kasi sideways trend pa yan. Remember, the trend is your friend. Uh, sideways trend is not your friend. So, test buy lang lagi. Wag po kayo mag-all in, please. Alright. So, mamaya na kayo mag in pag uptrend na yan. Um, but yeah, that's a very good position for AWG. Maganda, natin, maganda na siyang laruin. Bloom, uh, kasi very low risk. Bloom naman, 
we have uh, this right here for Bloom. Um, looking good to Bloom. Right? We have a triangle. Best entry is a breakout. But um, I think this is gonna break out already. We have good price action with Bloom already. Right? If you're a conservative player, antay nyo lang po muna mag breakout sa Bloom. But I think this bounce is already good. Um, it's okay to go aggressive in this stock since this is this stock is doing well naman. Right? So Bloom, that's okay already. Tech. Si tech naman, alright, so we have a very strong divergence here kay tech from here to here. And so, pataas na yan eh. From here to here. Actually, dito pa lang. Right? So, this is a very good divergence already for tech. Kaso nga lang, um, uh, hindi naman siya ganong kaliquid na stock. Medyo mabagal yung galaw niya. So, um, but this support is good. We just don't know when this is gonna move. But I want you to be here one before that moves. Right, these are low risk plays, right? So lagyan niyo lang ng konti kahit mga 5% lang ng port ninyo or 3% ng port ninyo laruin niyo for this one. At least may extra cash kayo. Pwede naman 'yan, 'di ba? So tech, right? That's for tech for Primex. Um Primex. Ayun, si Primex, um so stay the support, we have a bounce at the support right there. Right, you have the bounce already and then look at this divergence, very beautiful divergence for Primex. Nag-umpisa na siya umakyat. Um, it's already starting, um, yung RSI niya umakyat na meaning it's starting to gain momentum. So that's a good bottom for Primex. I recommend Primex really. Right, hindi lang natin alam kailan gagalaw yan. Kung hindi naman kayo nagmamadali, I don't want you to be in a hurry. That's a good position to test. FNI, so also FNI, we have good divergence already for FNI. Um... Prices are, this is so already starting to solidify. Very good support already for FNI. Okay, so look at the Bollinger Bands. Um, very stable ng price. So that's a good, uh, that's a good, uh, that's a good company to test out. We've, we've already hit hit the bottom RSIs for quite a while. So most more more or less maganda ni impression niya. Right, oversold levels ta siya. So FNI is good. Tignan ko nga si Ani. Sabi nila may divergence na si Ani. Uy, very good Ani, right? Mga pala no, right? So Ani is doing this. Um, hindi pa baba pa rin eh. Um Yes, ito nga divergence. So, yeah, Ani. Um Aso nga lang lakas pa ng downtrend ni Ani eh. Um, don't worry, this is still on a downtrend so hindi naman to aakyat kaagad. Most probably it's gonna make us a uh, support around this level before we wanna get in. I don't want you to be aggressive. So, most probably si Ani mag a higher low pa yan. Higher low will be our best confirmation for this. Baka bounce lang and then magtuloy-tuloy sa downtrend niya. So, ingat lang muna kay Ani. Right? So, nagda-downtrend pa siya. This is definitely a company I'm I'm watching out for. Um, kasi, um, ganda eh. Ganda na performance ng company niya yan. So, abang lang tayo kay Ani. So, those are my picks for today. Um, I wanna go to your um yes maganda po vlogs niya yoy nga pala si Monet has been watching the vlog so very good Lawrence Lloyd per Itoro asa na yan Sir sabi ni Jeff Gu dapat daw sa account nakapangalan yung payment account Ah okay so payment for for withdrawal dapat sa account nakapangalan yung payment account according sa email niya sa akin kaya nag-request pa ako ng credit card sa akin mismo I see I see thank you so much for letting me know Uko. guys I am not yet an expert in eToro, especially sa mga withdrawals and everything. Um, try to email this person, Jeff Gu, Jeff Gu at uh, eToro.com. That is he. That's this person is our dedicated support for Philippines. Ginawa na nila ng support sa Philippines. If ever dumami tayo sa Pilipinas mag eToro, dadagdagan nila yan. But so far, kaya pa naman ni Jeff. So good luck, Jeff. Ang dami nang tatanong sa'yo dahil sa akin. <laughs> Anyways, um yeah, um I'm still working my ways through Itoro. Natatawa nga ako guys. Um actually meron akong consultant ngayon sa sa Itoro. Uh, he is a student of mine. Um but when he introduced Itoro, mas mas grabe pa siya mag-research about Itoro. Uh uh siya pa nagturo sa akin pa na mag-sell half, siya pa nagturo sa akin um yung sa mga videos, bakit ganito, bakit ganyan. He referred me to this uh, YouTube channel. Ato ah, nga eh. So, yun. Um, sabi ko sa kanya, ikaw na ang consultant ko kasi ang alam ko lang mag-trade. If you want, eh, kung trade lang sa eToro, 
alam ko yan pero technicalities behind ito ro hindi ko pag anong expert so i'm i'm gonna spend a weekend siguro to movie marathon po itong person ito yung youtube channel niya uh, let, find out things that i don't know yet para ma-maximize ko naman yung earnings natin sa ito ro since i am already your fund manager and so medyo malaki na po yung responsibility ko kay ito ro hindi lang medyo right napakalaki na if you wanna check out my copy trading dashboard So this right here, I'm keeping it public since I really want my, you know, I really want my, uh, what do you call this? Um, my performance to be public, talaga. So right now we have a hundred k under me. So hundred k is around five million pesos under me. So I'm handling five million pesos pero po no matao yan. So that's why I have to be responsible in my trades. Um, ninety seven k na po tayo, almost a hundred k already. So ang laki po niyan. Hundred forty, uh, hundred sixty six copiers. Um. So it's a big responsibility. It's a big community already for me. So I have to be responsible in my trades. I need to learn more. Kaya you guys, ayon naman po yung opportunity. Alright, so um, you can diversify if you want to make trading your uh, profession. Uh, kung gusto niyo ng magin trader talaga kayo, this is the best venue to earn at the same uh, to earn. Uh, to maximize your earnings sa 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 trading. Dito kasi magandang market, so most probably you're gonna be earning in your trades and then magkakapit trade pa, so you g- g- gain extra pa, so mas marami po kaya mas malaki po yung mga kikita kikita ininyo. Right, so let's go to the requests of everyone. Unahin natin si IRC. Meron nagri request about IRC. Yan, so it's 8:57. Um, time check po. IRC somehow. Um. Sustaining pa man naman yung support, so antay lang tayo ng bounce. Kaya hindi ko po nare-record si RSC yet kasi I haven't seen the bounce yet. Maybe it's gonna bounce today. So if you want to be aggressive, pag nag-bounce yan today, pwede nyo po basukin. I always wait for the bounce before I recommend it. Si Tugs naman, um, so far, good bounce for Tugs, right? So, okay pa si Tugs. Nagbaba, nag, nagka-create pa ng support. Actually, okay na siya eh, right? Just get in your support as much as you can get tags. Very cheap ngayon si tags. So, it's still, um, it's still, uh, what do you call this? Um, stabilizing. Right now, it's on a sideways trend. So, get in your support. Yeah, nirecommend ko si tags dito, nirecommend ko ulit dito. So, most probably, um, tomorrow, ma-recommend natin to si tags. Right? So, Get in there that support as much as you can. PHA naman guys, si PHA umabot ng piso. So this is the reason why I always teach you to cut your losses, di ba? Kasi hindi natin alam saan aabot yan. I already cut my loss here. Um, and then nagreen siya. Kala ko magsisisi ako, but there it is. This is the reason why um nag ano tayo, nag nagkakat loss tayo. So now when it reached piso, it bounced. We have a strong bounce and now at 1.08. Kaso nga lang. Um, we have a downtrend pa guys. So, I don't want you to be aggressive on this. Siguro mag-engulfing pa yan and then make a higher low. That will be our best entry point to that. To know for sure if PHA has already stopped the downtrend niya. Right? Hindi naman for sure. So, at least may signals lang natapos din downtrend niya. Right? So, bounce at piso. We don't know what that bounce means, means yet. So, we can't really tell. Um, so PHA, abang na muna. So Tesla, may question about Tesla, right? Kamo sa ko si Tesla. It's is that is ito sa watch list ko. Eh. Chart niya. Um, negative pa si Tesla. Right. So malapit na sa support si Tesla. Most probably si Tesla ang i-open ko in the coming days. I'm just waiting for Tesla to show as a good sign of. Ito ini abangan ko eh, pag bumabagsak ng stock eh, di ba? So, I'm just waiting for Tesla to give me a signs of Um, buying before tayo papasok kay Tesla. So, most probably, isa yan sa mga papasukin natin in the future. So, Tesla. Alright, ISM. Alright, kamusta natin si ISM? Yesterday, si ISM ISM is um, still there. Alright, um, this is good after this is what I one of my lessons in Bollinger Bands. After an engulfing pattern, we wait for it to stabilize. Let's see what will happen. Alright, the support is sustaining. So, antay natin ang bounce. I think it's gonna bounce today, but antay nyo po yung bounce before kayo pumasok kay ISM. You can trade ISM actually. This is the the price action is telling us that this is this area is a very good support already. So, pag nagbounce yan, saka natin ni recommend si ISM. I don't want to recommend ISM yet for today. Um, Synaptic sir currently on the plunge. Tama. Um, so tignan ko rin yan mamaya. Um. 
Yan. So, next kay ISM is ATN. Kamusta natin sa ATN? So far, sideways. Um, bumagsak to 136. So, this is good. Yet, we are back to the support levels. Yet. So, I'm saying this is good because I'm into ATN for long term. Right? This is a good opportunity to buy more. Antay lang tayo ng bounce ng maganda before we wanna recommend ATN. I am recommending ATN for long term. But if you wanna trade ATN, kung gusto niyo may short term lang ng gains, then yan po range trade natin. Pag may green po dito, that's a very solid support for ATN. Pag may green tayo makita, pwede natin pasukin yan and then maybe we can take profits there. For short term traders kay ATN. Right now, wala pang bounce kay ATN. So, wag muna SCC. Right, so SCC, ayun. So, nagpo-pull back na si SCC. Let's just wait for SCC to make a bounce. Make a higher low, low perhaps. Pag nag-higher low yan, yeah, most probably pwede natin pasukin. Um, but as of the moment, wala pa. BPI. Ayun, si BPI. Um, nagpo-pull back pa. Let's just wait for the bounce of BPI. Antayin lang natin. AP. Uh-huh. AP. Ayan. So, antay natin yung sa support si AP. Narecommend ko si AP dito sa support niya. Alright. Um, around dito, dito ba yun? I think ito yung bounce niya. Tapos, nag-sustain naman. So, let's see what will happen in the future. AP, wala pa ngayon. Wala pang buy signal. Web naman. Si Web may bounce naman last ano. Kaso nga lang, downtrend pa si Web. I don't want to recommend it yet. Grabe, 2.65. Napakamura na ni Web. 2.65. Right? Amazing. So, let's see. Antayin lang natin yung earnings ni Web. Nihintay ko pa yung earnings ni Web sa annual earnings niya. So, third quarter, positive 61% naman siya. So, that's looking good. Um, Paul Hendricks, uh, we already checked out food. Uh, isa yan sa recommendation natin ngayon. Yung iba na sulat na naman. Unahin lang natin yung mga naka-request kanina pa. EEI. Ito si EEI. 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 Right. So, EEI... Meron tayong resistance na pababa eh. Right? So, these are alarming for EEI. We have lower highs. So, we don't know for sure where this is going. So, as much as possible, atayin niya lang ito sa support na lang niya, sa MA20. Right? So, that's, this is the best entry point for EEI. Atayin niya lang lumapit dyan. And then, let's see if that sustains. You can use MA20 as your support. If that sustains, then good sa EEI. Um, sorry, walang posting delayed lang pala. Um, from Blaze. Sorry, wala. Posting. Delayed lang pala. Alright. Ayan. Um, asa na ako? EEI. Next is VLL. Alright. So, VLL lang sa sideways pa rin. Alright. So, so far so good. We did recommend VLL on this support right here. And then, nagsusustain na naman siya. Right now, I'm not sure if it's gonna go up or not. But, get in near the support as much as possible. This is, uh, this is a good... Uh, position for VLL. Look at the Bollinger Bands. Nagiging constricted na naman. So, that's a very stable price already. Test out the support. Just in case you're wrong, just cut your losses for VLL. Right? Si FPH naman, there's something up with FPH, right? Ang ganda ng volume ni FPH lately. Um, so, this is good for FPH, right? Kaso nga lang, medyo high risk na um, I want you to enter the support as much as possible. Antayin nyo na lang po yung pullback. This is the best entry point. Sabi sa inyo, di ba? MA20. Look at that. MA20, MA20 bounces. There it is. So, we just wait for it to go back to MA20 para malit ang risk natin. Right? So, somehow, FPH is showing us um, good volume. May mga nagbubodega kay FPH. Eh. Um, SMC. Right? SMC. Um, kamusta na si SMC? Ayun. So, we did recommend SMC here dahil dun sa news niya. So far, so good. Kaso nga lang guys, konti ingat. We have a resistance right here. Antayin nyo lang yung breakout if you still wanna get in. SMC. Um, DMC. Ayan. May nagre-request about DMC. It's 905. Uh, DMC. Doing a pullback. Wait for the bounce lang tayo. Right? This do looking good for DMC. We did recommend DMC here. Maakit na siya. We're just waiting for, this is already a higher high. So guys, uptrend nito. Again, the trend is your friend. Most probably, this is gonna be an uptrend. A confirmation of an uptrend is a higher low. So anytime soon, pag nag-bounce yan, pasukin nyo na po si DMC. That's the, that's the uptrend right there, right? So DMC, abangan nyo na. So if ever, ito yung inaabangan ninyo, huwag nyo nang gagamitin ang pera ninyo para maghanap na ibang mga positions kahit paano pa dyan. 
abangan nyo po, upuan nyo po ito. Kung gusto nyo si DMC, then I strongly recommend DMC. I recommend the DMC here. Maganda yung mga news din DMC. So, launch 10 projects. Meron na namang news kanina. DMC ay to launch 10 projects. So, that's very good for DMC. DMC might go up today. Right? I wanna add DMC in my official list for today. DMC number one yan. So, baka mag-bounce to ngayon si DMC. Right? Uptrend yan, guys. Huwag nyo muna gagalawin ng pera ninyo. I will rec recommend ito DMC. Kung ito yung hinahanap ninyo. Right, nga pala, guys. If you wanna support the channel, if you like the contents that I'm making, you can donate to the channel. That will be a great help para matulungan po, makontinue yung program natin daily. Um, meron po yan super chat. Yan, um, sa chat room natin. Yan, um, may dollar sign po dyan. You can click on that and then you can donate whatever amount you want to. So, that's gonna be a very great help. Ayan, so, yeah, DMC. I strongly recommend DMC. Antay natin yung bounce niya. Pwede natin pasukin yan. May magandang yung si DMC ngayon. Launch 104 billion projects 11 hours ago. DMC may press release si DMC yesterday. So, tignan nga natin. This is something good. I wanna put DMC in my number one pick for today. Um, DMC I home I stand projects launches for 2019. Quadruple. Blah, blah, blah. This is good for DMC. So, yeah. Yan, DMC. Pwede nyo, pwede nyo pasukin yan. Yan yung abangan nyo ngayon. That's an uptrend, guys. Please. Yan po. Huwag nyo sasayangin yung trend. Alright. So, DMC. Good job. Thank you so much sa so, nag-question about DMC. Hindi ko napansin si DMC, ah. Um, SMPH. And sa SMPH, uh, yun. Si SMPH, medyo mataas ni. Alright. We are nearing resistance levels. Uh... Let's see what will happen. I don't want you to enter it right now. Kasi mataas yung risk, uh, mataas yung risk and the re reward is not that worth it. Uh, Elvi Aquino, good morning Sir Lloyd. Just started copy trade you in eToro. Thank you so much. Right, good morning Sir Lloyd. I've been watching social trading blog for a time now. Really helpful. Was watching about the dividends because we can only get a percentage of dividend amount sa eToro. Tama yan, right? So I did check about it. I, I had a question about that. So yung problema sa, div, uh, sa eToro is... Hindi naman siya problema, really. Uh, eToro is a CFD broker. CFD meaning, it allows you, eToro allows you to trade a portion of a stock. Right? Kasi nga, in return, hindi mo hindi mapapangalan sa'yo yung stock. Only the value of the stock goes to you. Kasi for example, um, Amazon, right? Amazon itself, right? For example, you wanna trade Amazon. Look at that. Per stock ni Amazon, $1,761. Not everyone can afford that. Right? That's around 100k per stock. Right? So, ito yung sinasabi sa inyo lagi. Uh, uy, thank you so much. I am medic for the <laughs> for the super chat. Thank you so much for that. That's greatly appreciated. But going back to the point, 1,761. Right? To own an Amazon stock, you have to have almost 100k. Diba? Um, Not all Filipinos have that. That's the problem. Right? This is the reason. Ito yung ginawa kong video isang weekend about the con uh, the contrast of the international market parami ng parami ang mga i mean palayo ng palayo ang gap ng mayayaman tsaka mal hindi mayayaman di ba why because the the rich people have access to money and they can invest in amazon tayo na hindi naman mayaman hirap tayo pumasok kay amazon kaya po sila yung mayaman lalo kasi si amazon lumalaki sila lang ang yung mayaman dahil kay Amazon. Now, here comes Itoro. He's a CFD broker. I hope by now you know that Itoro is not a scam, right? Um, CFD broker, meaning, pwede ni Itoro i-divide yung Amazon na $1,761, i-divide it into how many units, and then, pwede nyo pong um, bilhin ng maliitan. Right? Parang isang sakong bigas itong si Amazon. Kung hindi nyo kayang bilhin nyo isang sakong bigas, pwede kayong bumili na isang kilo, dalawang kilo. Ganyan. That's the point of it. So, in exchange for that, um, yun nga lang, hindi mapapangalan sa'yo yung stock. Right? It will not be named after you. Itoro will be handling the stock. Pero a portion of it goes to you. The value goes to you. So, yung pera na factor ng stock, pupunta sa'yo. Pero at least, we can get, take advantage of the value growth already. Right? Owning a stock, pangasa sa mga investor naman yan. And we're, we're here for trading. Right? So, hindi na, hindi, we don't really care about who the stock 
is named after. So, with that, dividends, yung dividends na binibigyan ni Amazon, kung ilan units yung hawak mo, for example, yung units na hawak mo is right, half of the full value of Amazon's one stock, then that means na half lang ng dividends mapupunta sa'yo. So, that's the advantage of it. Sab um, so, yun. Um, that's my point. So, I, um, Itoro has given us that opportunity para po makapag we can, uh, we, makakuha naman tayo, matikman naman natin yung yung yaman na other other people are um, uh, enjoying. Yeah, that's why we're going to Itoro. Right? So, it means pala sir na uh, para liquidate, you don't own anything. Tama yan. The thing is, in Itoro, I don't think Amazon is gonna be liquidated. Itoro only trades, pwede lang itrade natin sa Itoro are the uh, companies that are big. Right? Only big companies. Only stable companies. Kung baga, blue chips lang pwede natin i-trade sa eToro. Right? So, hindi po nag-trade, hindi po allowed sa eToro ang trading ng mga uh, ng mga basura stocks or the, what do you call this? Uh, what do you call this? Um, penny stocks. Yan. Penny stocks on terms sa kanila. Eh. Right? So, hindi po kayo makahanap ng maliliit ng company sa eToro. Right? So, para protected tayo dyan sa liquidation. Anyways, we're only in it for short term lang naman. Hindi naman tayo naglo long term. So, if you want to be an investor really, kung gusto nyo po talaga yung mapapangalan talaga sa inyo, um, Itoro's not the place for that. Safety trading lang kasi si Itoro. So, yun. Uh, so, good 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 question. Break the cycle. Johnny Lim, good morning sir. This April po copy trading sa Itoro. Any advice? Di ko po makuha yung tama na service sa simula. Send me a message, Johnny Lim, so that I can give you the, ano, the, what they call this, uh, the cheat sheet. O nga pala. So, guys, nandito. Um, go to our um, chat room. Right? So, chat room natin. Meron tayong Itoro lunch. Lounge. Lunch. Tuloy. Lounge. Right? So, Itoro lounge. Um, may nakapin ako dito eh right? may nakapin ako dito in this page meron niya activating copy trading right? just go to the pinned messages andyan po yung kodigo right? kodigo po yan for copy trading so that you can activate a copy trading if you haven't joined the discord group yet this is our discord group andyan po sa video description meron po dyang discord group invitation link click on that you can join the discord group already Everything is for free, right? So, uh, main chat room natin, Trader's Lounge, dito yung mga mga kulit, right? But this is the main lounge, dito yung mga um, medyo civilized na mga tao na gustong trading lang ang pinag-uusapan. Um, uh, dito sa Trader's Lounge, dito yung mga kulit, hindi natin mapipigilan, maraming mga kukulit, eh. nakita nyo naman. So, we just uh, we just make to try as much as possible, we make the, ano, we make the um, chat room healthy. Alright, so Investor's Lounge, ito naman, investing naman ang topic lang dito. Meron tayong eToro Lounge, all for eToro, right? Uh, marami pong matutulong eh, sa inyo dito. Alright, so charting discussions, we have that. If you're a newbie, this chat room is gonna be very uh, beneficial for you. So download Discord, then just go to that link. Map mapasok po kayo. Started copy trading you, Mentor Lloyd, literal na let's get rich together. Totoo yan, right? So whatever I earn in the future, in percentage, you're gonna earn it also, right? So... So far, so good. Um, the statistics that we have, we are now at, we are running, ayaw mag-load, we're running 5.91% ang gains natin for March. So, those is that is how much those people who are copy trading me are earning already. Right? So, for this month, I mean, for this year, running na tayo ng 12%. Right? So, congratulations po sa mga nag-copy trade sa akin. Huwag niyo po sasayin yung opportunity. Ako na po mag-trade sa inyo. Right? Para sa inyo. Right? Let's continue. Um, sino yung last? Si SMPH SMPH We still have time IRC We talked about IRC already CPG Medyo mataas na CPG Alright, so CPG guys Antay lang tayo ng pullback Before we wanna get in CPG again Um, CPG ABA Ito si ABA Alright Um I don't wanna recommend it yet Uh, I think ABA has it's gonna be consolidating uh, anytime soon. So, medyo mahal na kasi si Abe. Again, guys, walang forever na uptrend ha. So far, it's showing us okay pa naman yung main uptrend line niya. But these are, it's, it's already starting showing us lower high. So, uh, red flag muna ako kay Abe. Hindi ko muna lalaroin yan kasi medyo mataas na. Right. So, good morning, Sir Lloyd. Ano ang recommendation ngayon? Late na kasi ako napanood. Let me post my recommendations again. So, I'm adding DMC on my official list for today. Isa sa mga paborito ko ngayon si DMC. 
Alright, so ayun, um DMC SMPH IRC CPG aba ah, FLI, kamusta natin si FLI? Um Wait, thank you so much Encarnacion, Joel, magandang umaga. Thank you so much for the donation, for the super chat. Um Ayan, um, may question ginabing ko kay Anyuan Sayo Coach. Ilang days po ang ah, suspen- suspension sa call kapag nag-withdraw? Plano ko kasi kumuha ng fund sa call account to fund ito. Uh, sa call financial, it has, be, uh, it has to be that that fund that you have has not been used for 3 days. Right? So, dapat floating fund yan for 3 days before mo ma-withdraw. And then, ayan, ang alam ko, 3 days lang naman makukuha nyo kaagad si call. Eh. So, uh, yeah, si Aba X Day Today, tingnan natin kung ano ang mangyayari sa kanya. Baka bumagsak. And yan, that's the volatility that I'm staying away from. Right, so, si FLI, uy, guys, ito, um, nag-break out kapon si FLI. It created a support for, I mean, a resistance for 3 days. Nag-break out, pero hindi nag-sustain. But the volume is good. Most probably, it's gonna do a breakout today. Hopefully, it does break out. So, FLI on breakout, if you are after FLI, IRC. So, FLI on the breakout lang po muna. Right. Um... Sir, okay na po ba pasok kay Tugo? Thanks po. O nga pala, si Tugo, mag- gumaganda ang, ga- ang galaw eh. So, let's check out Tugo later on. Um, may Tugo ako, ipit ako sa Tugo. Hindi ako nakapag-cutloss nung pumunta ako sa, <laughs> sa what do you call this? <laughs> sa Dubai, right? For the seminar. Ah, speaking of the seminar nga pala, guys. Um, if you wanna join the seminar, if you wanna learn how to trade, um, wag nyo po sasayangin yung oras um, you can learn trading on your own ito guys you can learn trading on your own kahit wala pong seminar yes you can but you have to there's, you have you have to respect learn um, take it from me it's gonna take a while to learn how to trade right so along that time na magpa-practice ka you're gonna lose money right so that's why I'm recommending just do, join the seminar instead this way you can do shortcut right you can cut your learning curve. Hindi mo na kailangan mga pa sa dilim just because of a 4,000 pesos. That's how cheap my seminars are. I have a seminar this Friday and Saturday, only 4,000 pesos. Send me a message so I can send you the details and information about the seminar. Friday, Saturday, 8 in the evening. Two hours po yan each. It's a workshop. May activities tayo on day one that gagawin natin on day two. Right? So, yun. Um, send me a message if you wanna join that. Uh, para hindi na po kayo mga pa sa dilim. Um, my performance in eToro should be proof enough for you guys to um, uh, to show that my system is working. So, we're earning right now. Itong pinakamalaking cut loss ko, this is my fault. <laughs> Negative 6. Kasi si cryptocurrency, nagbet ako kay Bitcoin dito. Ito yung nag-support siya. Kasi na si Bitcoin, walang, ka- walang stop loss. Right? Yun yung problema sa cryptocurrency. Kaya ayaw ko mag-trade sa cryptocurrency. Walang stop loss sa itoro so nung bumagsak siya hindi nagcut loss lumaki ang talo ko yun yung problema doon so dapat nagcut loss ako noon maliit lang sana yung loss doon anyways yeah the system is um the system is working right um if you want to learn my trading system you want to trade on your own join the seminar that's going to be a very big help for you well said sg morales well said on itoro congrats sa mag add more pa ako this week sana umabot sa reset mo sir yet so hopefully soon right sana umabot um, next kay FLI, antay nyo lang kayo, antay lang kayo ng breakout for FLI. Um, IRC, we talked about IRC already. DD, ayan, si Double Dragon. Um, ganda na volume ni DD kahapon eh. Right, here is the volume of DD. Kaso nga lang, yeah, uh, basically this is a higher low. Right, ang ganda na press action nito. This is what I usually wait for, diba? Ito yung engulfing pattern that I teach about Bollinger Bands. Um, this is the stabilization that I'm waiting for, the higher low. This is the reason why I recommended DD yesterday, diba? I recommend ko si DD kahapon because of this. And then there it is, good volume and bounce. I think magsusustain naman ito. This is our support for DD. That's still an entry. Right, hindi ko na sinulat si DD ngayon kasi nasulat ko na yung kahapon. Right, so... Right. Um, ayun. Um, asa na ako? I'm just reading the comments. Nag-withdraw po ba sa ito? 25 lang or may ibang fees pa? Ayan. Okay. So, from haha. Uh, pag nag-withdraw ba sa ito? 25 dollars lang or may ibang fees pa? Pag nag-withdraw ka, 25 dollars lang po. Right? Um, it sounds big. But, alam nyo po ba sa ito? Is, um, 
nagpinapasweldohan po nila yung mga nagka-copy So, eToro has to get funds also. $25 is not that much. Considering na, eto isa, isa sa mga isa sa mga nag ano kahapon nag comment kahapon look at this right here so isa sa mga nag comment kahapon si Omar Mendoza right so Omar Mendoza I use the link of Itoro your sir from you sir I gain one thousand three hundred dollars na hahaha <laughs> sabi niya so um one na na nagain niya so if he withdraws $1,300, magkano rin $25 ibabalik natin kay Itoro para ibigay nila sa mga kinopyahan ninyo, di ba? So, that's a very small amount, right? Meron kasing basher kay Itoro. Hindi ko napapangalanan, baka sumikat. <laughs> so, and isa sa point, pinoint ayot niya, bakit ako mag, ano, for, for $25? Ang laki niyan, sayang kayong pera ko, mag-withdraw ako, tapos kukunan nila. Ay, nako, napakaliit ng, ah, ay, <laughs> napakaliit ng, Takbo ng utak. This person has earned $1,300 si Omar, di ba? And then $25 lang kukunin ni Itoro. He did nothing. Wala siyang ginawa. That's a very big bar. That's a very good bargain. So, that should not be an issue. Right? Di ba? So, yun. Sir RRHI po. Let's check that out. Kung may oras pa. 9.22 ang daldal ko. <laughs> right? So, DD, kahapon ko yung nareko. Actually, okay pa siyang bilhin. Pwede po pong humabol kay DD. Maganda yung volume kahapon. So, that should be something that you should be looking at. Um, CHP nang po pull back. So we are reaching this uptrend line ni CHP. Right, so CHP, test nyo po yung uptrend line niya. Antayin lang natin pag nag-bounce diyan. Gusto kabig lahat eh, grabe na 'yan. Right, so yan, um CHP uh MRC. MRC um downtrend pa guys. So iwas muna kay MRC. Yan, kaya po hindi ko pa siya ni-recommend. Yan. Um Papahabol si SMC. Medyo mataas na si SMC, guys. Uh, we already talked about that. Kanina, um, SMC, medyo mataas na. Tignan na lang natin. Silipin na lang natin. Yan, no? uh, so, yan. Tapos na tayo kay SMC. MRC, Poopy, si Poopy. Um, Bollinger Band is telling us na most probably it's gonna consolidate already. So, ayoko na po yung recommend si Poopy. Uh, we recommended Poopy here, the divergence, na alalan nyo po yan. And then, MA20 bounce, another MA20 bounce. Those are the best entry points kay Poopy. Ngayon, medyo mataas na si Poopy. I don't wanna recommend it. Pero, yeah, we could be wrong. Pwede naman tayo magkamali. So, MA20, tingnan natin mamaya sa, si Poopy sa MA20. Right? So, wag muna as of the moment. Si Mac, hindi naman nag-breakout. So, wag muna kay Mac. Breakout po yung inaabangan natin kay Mac or ME20 bounce, right? So, wala pa si Mac. Um, I don't want to recommend ME20 bounce nga lang kasi yung resistance natin malapit na. So, not enough risk to reward ratio. So, um, konti ingat lang. Uh, Amil Angelo, sir, may copier na ako. I'm so touched. Uh, proud and happy. Thanks you. Thank you talaga sa learnings. I'm also sharing. Pero wag po kayo mag-alala. Di ako nang iniingil. <laughs> Right, that's good, right? Dapat ang tinuturo natin is for free. Yun nga lang, may seminar ako na for with a fee. But I'm gonna be spending time with you guys. Yun lang. Right, uh, pero marami naman tayong earn, uh, learnings na binibigay for free. Mas marami nga yung for free, eh, di ba? <laughs> so, yan. Um, Poopy, Mac, uh, CHIB. Si Mac, guys, um, antay nyo lang yung breakout. Breakout yung best entry kay Mac kung gusto nyo po maghabol. CHIB, CHIB naman. Uy, meron na tayong support. Let's see if this will hold in soon. So, antayin lang natin muna. Overall, napakamura pa rin ni CHIB. Um, divergence yan. Ang ganda ng divergence yan, guys. So, tingnan nyo po yung RSI. Full screen ko lang ito. RSI still going up. Right, that's very beautiful RSI for CHIB. So, pag nag-bounce yan, pwede nyo po testing yan. Just test by, again, the trend is your friend. Sideways trend pa yan. So, huwag nyo muna lalagyan ng malaking pera. Um, CHIB, SECB, SECB. Ayan, so SECB. Ayan. Uy, yung nga pala, 925 na. Right, so last lang ito. Pasensya na hindi ko masasagot lahat. Right, so kasi may lakad pa ako. Um, SECB. Hard to say. Medyo mataas na SECB. Let's see if ever we can see a breakout from SECB. Right? Breakout will be the best entry point for SECB. Uh, we have an engulfing pattern right here. This is the uh, this is the stabilization of look um, where I'm talking about. We have a support. So, if ever mag-support naman siya, we can get in that or breakout. That's, those are the best entries. Right, so that's it for today. Pasensya na. Um, nalate tayo ngayon. May bagong interface si Live. Eh, so, hindi ko po ma masagap pa ang paano siya gawin. So, tomorrow, I'll see you again. 
Uh, it was a very good discussion with you guys today. Again, as always, let's get rich together. Enjoy your day. Bye, guys. Oh